Okay, so keep going for chapter two, the JFET. So now we learn about the one of the type is gate bias JFET here. Okay, so now that was for like this one. This is R sub D. R sub D is the drain register and V sub DD the plus the power supply for the drain and anti the JFT. So this is Y right there. So um, that was negative voltage here. Okay. So on negative gate voltage of minus V sub GG here uh, is applied to the gate through the biasing register here, okay? So this is why the drain current is much less than I sub DSS, okay? So, okay, so the first over uh, JFET uh, could be biased in the ohmic regions um, or the active reason, okay? So the ohmic regions the JFT, the purpose like a register. Okay, so it could be in the um, the ohmic regions, the bias gate, the gate bias my JFT that should be redraw like this one. So R sub D. So that was R sub DS. Okay, like this one. So JFT work as um, R sub DS, okay? And um, the active reasons is for the perpum as the active ones, like as the current sources. So um, actually there are the two requirement and formula for I sub D saturation for gate biasing on JFT and the, uh, on the only reasons. So first of all, V sub G as zero volt is kind of off. That was I sub D, which is I sub DSS. Okay. And um, that was I sub D saturations. So I sub DSS is much less than the I sub DSS. So from here, that was for the formula. The I sub D saturation is the equal to V sub DD divided the R sub D. I sub D saturations, that was I sub DSS, when was V sub GS is equal to zero, okay? That is the drain curve, okay, V sub DS, and that was V sub DD, okay? That was the Q point, okay? Okay, that is I sub D and V sub DS, okay? All right, so we got out, it's really uh, basic and simple, the sample questions, all right, so, the example here, the space of ED and R sub D here. This is the JFET um, for R sub G, R sub GG. Okay. That was as, this is gate, this is my drain, right? So we assume that V sub DD is 10 volt and R sub D, the 10 K ohm here, and R sub G is one mega ohm here. Um, and we have also the pinch voltage. It's like four voltage. The pinch voltage means like this one here. Um, the pinch voltage is the point could be uh, distinguished is the um, ohmic reasons. And um, the active reasons. So, I sub DSS is 10 million, okay? All right, so the question one, so what is the I sub D saturations? I sub D saturations, I mean, if we wanted to find I sub D saturations, that should be conditioned for that is operated in the, the um, ohmic reasons, right? So for this case, for V sub DD divided R sub D, 
that was 10 volt divided the 10 kilo ohm here, finally 1 million, okay? That is the I sub D saturations. And what is the relationship I sub D saturations and um, I sub D SS? That is from the given, the 10 million. So I sub D saturations less than I sub D SS, right? So that was one of the requirements that could be operated the ohmic regions. Do you remember in the ohmic regions, the JFET, the operated for register the um, R sub DS? So what is for R sub DS? So R sub DS, if that was the ohmic region. So R sub DS, the peak voltage divided the I sub DSS, that is the 10 milliamp over four voltage, okay? So, so after calculations, that was 400 ohm here. All right, so what is the V sub D? Uh, in the um, ohmic reasons, uh, in the ohmic reasons. So for this case, um, V sub D, the 10 volt, 400 over 400 plus the 10K, okay? That was 385 millivolt, okay? Because do you remember this is V sub DD, this is R sub D, and this is V sub D, this is R sub DS, so the voltage divider rule here. So this is Y right there, okay? This is, um, so R sub D is for 400, right? I know um, R sub D is the 10K and R sub DS 400 ohm because we got this one, the previous questions. Okay. So the finally, we're gonna draw for the drain curve. The drain curve is Y axis I sub D here and X axis V sub DS. That was V sub DD, that was the 10 volt, right? And um, that point, I sub D saturation, this is the road line um, that was, we have calculated one milliamp here, right there. Um, and pinch voltage, V sub P, the full voltage, that is the only region, that is the active regions. And I sub DSS, this is the given, 10 milliamp, when what? V sub GS, the zero volt. Yeah, we learned before if they have increased with sub GS, for example, with sub GS minus one volt, GS minus two volt, maybe I sub DSS, it was decreased. And the with sub GS minus four volt is like the cutoff voltage. It was the almost my zero, okay? That point, uh, that was really big, P type, P type is maybe N type. The channel is almost really, really small one because the increase the width um, of the channel, okay? So this is why, because that was, of GS, it was the reverse one here, okay?